Hey gang, people often ask me, hey Marcel, how do I avoid toxic management? How will I know I work for a toxic boss? Well, if it's not obvious by now, there are some universal bad boss behaviors that I personally would label as toxic. Here we go, number one, your manager or management team lives and dies by bureaucracy. There's too many levels of approval and too many cooks in the kitchen to get things done, which which means the focus is on micromanaging employees. Two, your manager can't clearly communicate. So employees have no idea what's really going on. And this causes a lot of fear and confusion and anxiety in the minds of workers. And the last one is this. Your manager or management culture has little to no concern for work-life integration. So people's personal or family lives are sacrificed for the job. There's you know, a little flexibility to get out of the office and, and manage personal things. And you just feel guilty asking for vacation time. So there you have it. Three ways that I have seen a toxic boss in action. If you have any questions, shoot me a direct message and I'll see you next time.